say, and this is my project, Rapid Changes. I've chosen a landslide, and now I'm going to tell you facts about landslides. Landslides happen when huge amounts of rock, mineral, and soil slide down a mountain. Landslides occur mostly in hilly places. They're usually triggered by earthquakes, volcano, flash flood, or other major events. As mudslides slide down the slope, houses get destroyed. By planting trees, the tree's roots can help hold loose soil together and prevent landslides. Landslides can move up to 35 miles or 56 kilometers per hour. An avalanche is just like a landslide, but made of snow. And that's how landslides happen. The, thank you. Any questions? I do. Okay. My question was, how many types of these things are there? Avalanches, mudslides, and normal landslides. I think those are the um, different kind of landslides. Three. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's all I have. Where, where do landslides usually come in from? In hilly places. And or areas. Never. <laughs> I don't know that. Any... It's interesting. <laughs> Wait, that's a statement, not, not a question. We like to put statements on that. Okay. Wow, we Thank you. <laughs> how, how did you do this process? Okay, first, I did some research and took some notes about landslides. Then I prepared a blueprint for my model, and I listed out all the materials needed for the project. I took a carton box and a cardboard sheet and put a hole in both, and placed a connector in between them and stuck them together. Then I stuck a carton box at the bottom of my slide and crushed paper at the top. Remember not to cover the hole. kitchen towel and toilet paper roll to make houses, train carriages, and caves. I cut out cardboard sheets to make train tracks and road. I gathered some sticks from my lawn and broke it into different sizes. I used empty matchbox to make train carriages.
that, I made trees with the sticks I collected and stuck artificial leaves and set it aside for drying. You may wonder why I'm wearing gloves and mask. That's because I'm going to use plaster of Paris. It is not good for lungs. So always wear a mask when you have to handle plaster of Paris. I mixed plaster of Paris, soil, and water and quickly put it on the model. This will create nice texture like a real mountain slope. Remember not to cover the hole. Until it dries, I painted out houses, train tracks, and carriages. And caves, I also painted out. Painted old buttons for carriage wheels. Now my hair is dry and ready for painting. I suck the buttons and the connections for the carriage. for lining the pond. Then I used crushed paper for land area and covered with soil. I placed a pond in the middle and put some rocks for support and placed the road. Now I need to put lamp post at the roadside so I could I cut a hole in the shape of a cave and pass the battery through the hole and stuck it outside the box. I checked if the lights are working before I put the tracks and cave in the place. I use some sticks to support the bridge from falling. Now I use my Lego as fence for my farm animals. I painted out the sky with blue and white and used teal at the end to show different shades in the sky. I stuck small sticks to show chopped trees and stuck the trees I made earlier. Now I put out my tiny animals and other decorative properties. Then I used blue slime for the pond water. I also added some moss and plants for the real field. Check out the turtle and fish in the pond. That's my favorite part. I also use some Lego properties like bike, man, tools, chainsaw, signboard, and lampposts. Mm -hmm. 
Then I stuck the toy train and the carriages to the track and filled it with logs. I decorated the top of the cave with artificial leaves and flowers. Check out the eagle, elephant, tiger and the bat I added to the tree side of the hill. Just to show that People are destroying animal habitats by cutting down trees in hilly forest. I stuck the battery at the side and also stuck a cup at the back on the hole to help the soil and water mixture pass through easily. And that's how I made this model. Thank you! And by the way, the music track you are listening along in this video is played by me. Now here comes the fun part of the project. The demonstration of my model. Da, da, da! I'm going to use soil and water to make a muddy slide. The rainwater mixes with soil and rocks and causing muddy slides in hilly areas and damage everything on its path. Wow, that's the end of my project. Hope you like it. Please leave comments. Thank you.